Let's go to Numbers chapter 6. This is the Aaronic blessing. This is the, the word that God gave to Israel from the priests to speak over them. Here it goes. The Lord spoke to Moses saying, speak to Aaron and his sons, saying to them, this is the way you shall bless the children of Israel. Say to them, the Lord bless you and keep you. Lord, make his face to shine upon you. Be gracious to you. Lift up his uh, countenance towards you and give you peace. So they shall put my name on the children of Israel and I will bless them. This is a common blessing you hear in all kinds of places. Protestant, Catholic, Judaism as well. You hear it in contemporary services, formal services, liturgical services. You hear it in small groups, big groups alike. It's a blessing, a favor. It's not a bad, a bad thing to read on a regular basis. Read this text off in Numbers chapter 6. Read these words. Let them speak to you today because God wants to bless you. But in this text is clarity. First of all, this text is about who is blessing, not who's getting blessed. It's about him, his presence, his face, his favor. May the Lord do this. May the Lord do that. The Lord will do this. The Lord will do that. Knowing that he's the one is about him, not about us. That's what worship is. Turning what happens to you back toward him. It's about him today. Blessing is connected to the face or presence of God. His face, may his face shine upon you. That's identity with connection. Faces are memorable. If you're like me, I can forget or not even know your name, but I will know your face. Have you ever said the phrase, oh, you're trying to think of a, per a name, you go, oh, 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 what's his face? You ever said that before? Yeah. Isn't that funny why you say, what's his face? Because the face tells you who it is. The face is the connection. May his face, may who he is shine upon you. May intimacy, may bonding take place. May you know him. He's the God that knows you. He's the God that wants you to know him more. He's the God that knows your name, your history, your, your past, your present, your future. He, wants, he knows everything and he loves you just like you are. May his knowing shine upon you. Face be with you. It's about him today. It's about the idea that God wants to bless you because you're his creation. Blessing is walking every day in his grace and walking out his grace. We are the recipients of the grace of heaven. We're blessed by the goodness of God. May we, each one of us, give back to somebody else that which we've received. Believers in Jesus Christ should be the most gracious, loving, kind people on the earth because he has done that for us. He's been good to us, gracious to us, kind to us, long-suffering toward us. How many thank God that he's been gracious in your life? He's been faithful to you today. He's been gracious in every capacity. He loves you so much. We should be the same as somebody else.